See how many calories I can burn cleaning my bedroom. You know when you've been sat on your phone for ages and you think, I'm going to get up and do something with my life? And that is exactly what happened to me. So I'm going to start with the bed frame and give it a little freshen up with some surf disinfectant, just giving it a quick little hoover first. And then I'm just going to get stuck right in. This just makes my bed smell so fresh. It's so nice when I sit in it afterwards. We've started now, so I'm fully committing to every single side. Not going to lie, I did have some sus stains on my bed, so I didn't have bicarbonate of soda, so I just used some carpet stain remover and it worked quite well. These bedside tables love to get dusty right onto the corner pile i swear this is clean washing but it was on my bed then i had to get in my bed so it just ended up in the corner i haven't done this in so long getting right in the corners because you know when you're hoovering it doesn't quite get all the edges Eek. i knew this would be bad i'm not gonna lie i never look behind this door so let's get rid of all that dust then i looked up for the first time in a long time and there's literally cobwebs <laughs> so let's get rid of those that reminds me has anyone heard the stat on how many spiders you apparently eat in your sleep onto the window ledge just ignore the building site that's behind me i can only imagine what those builders think i'm up to when they see me running around with my tripod in here by this point my phone was absolutely gagging for charge so i had to have a little break while i charged it but just to update you we have burned 323 active calories in an hour and 15 minutes and we are back decided to do my daily affirmation just to give me the strength to go on slight problem the bed was still a little bit wet from where i cleaned off the stains had to dig out my old hair dryer because the dyson was doing nothing just a little smidge of crease releaser i knew i'd forgotten something the bed was looking weird i forgot to put those front pillows on okay a little bit of a breeze and we are done and we burned 610 total calories when I was a kid, I was constantly overwhelmed by cleaning my room, so I made up a game to help me. I would throw an object, and whatever the object landed next to, I would pack away those things, and then I would throw the object again. Today, I felt super overwhelmed by how messy my room had gotten and did not know where to start, so I decided to play the game. This game is the only thing that would ever get me to clean my room as a kid. I think it's an effective game because by throwing the object, it's taking away that choice of where to start. I was diagnosed later in life, so it was really interesting to look back on the strategies I used to use as a kid to get stuff done. Using my phone to record myself cleaning my room also helped because it meant I wasn't distracted by my phone. Whenever I clean my room, I make sure I have a basket of stuff that needs to go in other areas of the house. I do this because it means less little piles of stuff in my room to go away and less overwhelm. And it means I can just carry this one thing around the house putting stuff away rather than going back to my room a million times. Some of the stuff I've been meaning to put away for months. Stuff that I need to put in my car, I put with my keys so I make sure I don't forget and that it doesn't end up back in my room. Thankfully, it's a warm day here in Australia, so I was able to hang up my bedsheets, which I've been meaning to do for a really long time. 
and I knew that they were dry in the time that I still had motivation to get them back onto my bed. I ended up having the day off today, so I had time to get two loads of washing done, and to be honest, I only hung out this second load because of this video. And here is the finished product. Thank you.